and I'm going to record this video for you and um, today we're going to be doing episode 4 and you know what wow I hope you guys love the first 3 episodes that I recorded we are nearly coming towards the end um, as I said look I'm sorry I'm a little bit tired of just I've just finished work and I've just come to record you this so let's play episode 4 of Game of Thrones Telltale series and here's why Walker says do the dead frighten you so let's see if it does so guys hope you've been good I hope everything's been alright as I said, I hope you enjoyed the first three episodes of Game of Thrones that I've recorded. Um, obviously, I'm going to do parts, but I'm going to try something different today, see if I can get two chapters. Each one, if one chapter is going to be long, then it's going to be long. And so you can see how, let's see how this works. I've just today I've bought uh, the Batman Telltale series and I got Tales of the Borderlands, so I'm going to be playing them as well. Just contemplating of making the videos. Previously so, on Game of Thrones. Thrones. My father is planning to make a move against your family. He knows all your weaknesses, all your plans, because you have a traitor in your council. He's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. We were told we'd be speaking to Lord Tyrion alone. That's enough, Andros. North Grove? That's just some shit story for little kids. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a bastard? It means a lot to be able to share that with someone. Someone I can trust. And if it isn't Elena Glenmore, you're not still marrying into this wretched family. I'm sorry. I'm going to tell Father the betrothal is off. It's a long journey to Marine on foot. Marine? What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. If you dragons, you best choose your words carefully. Malcolm! Are you gonna be a good little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down? Can be Lord Roderick, so long as we all know who holds the reins here. The foresters need to keep their end of the bargain. Take the boy as your ward. Kill him if they give you any trouble. I never did tell you about your father, did I? We bled him at first, like a pig. <laughs> So guys, that's what's happened previously on Game of Thrones from episode 3. So let's see what happens in episode 4 today. Ooh, found the buddy. I knew so you were a killer Toto. the day you arrived. Seems Brit found out too. Now they all see it. What sort of brother you really are. 
It wasn't my fault. He attacked me, and... and we fought, and... So you struck him down and left him to die? You tried to lie about what you did to get here. But we both know you had blood on your hands. But now, you've killed one of your brothers. You'll lose your head for this, Tuttle. You'll be disgraced, dishonored, and burned till there's nothing left of you. I swear by all the gods, old and new, this was an accident. I didn't mean for him to die. <laughs> didn't mean it. Murder's in your blood. There's only one thing to be done with you now. Hey, Frostfinger. I saw what Garrett did to Brit last night. I was there. My relief was late, so I stayed behind. I saw everything. Yeah, he was there. Then go on. What did you see, boy? Garrett's telling the truth. Brit attacked him. Just like he what? said, Garrett had no choice but to fight back. There isn't a man at the wall wouldn't sell his own mother for the <laughs> right price. You two are up to something. He defended me? What? Some deal you worked out. Or he's defending you for... Finn's just being a good brother. I think... Can't watch a man die and just... I decide what justice is. Oh, do you know? Garrett killed a man of the watch. There's a price to be paid for that. Let's go. I knew it was a mistake to make you a ranger. Rossfinger! What's to be done with him? We're heading to Crusted. You'll have to find someone else for your expedition. Your man here still has a lot to answer for. Now out of the way, Snow. Give us a moment. Then he said, give us a moment. Be done with it. Garrett. God damn it. You told me you wouldn't get into it with Brit. What happened? I thought you were smarter than that, Garrett. Mm. I thought you were going to be by my side at Crusters. But there's no coming back from this. I know I did the right thing. That's all that matters. What Brit did to your family, anyone would want him dead. But now you'll have to face the consequences. But John... I'm sorry, Garrett. There's nothing more I can do. We're down a man, so keep your eyes open. Now let's move. Seems even your mother's abandoned you. Won't be alone for long, though. The Axeman will find you soon enough. Oh? I'm truth in this one. So obviously, it's going to be quite weird. So now I want to know what's going to happen in this episode. Um, am I going to get killed? Is Garrett going to get killed? Is it going to be stay alive? What's going to happen to him? So we, we, as you stay tuned, we're going to find out. Um, but also Game of Thrones episode 7, sorry, season 7 episode 1 came out. Oh my god, it was amazing. I'm not going to say anything. To, for those who have not seen it but it was worth watching and you know what uh, it's gonna go really crazy so well um, obviously in the last episode we saw Daenerys and you know what we're just gonna see what's gonna happen here see what she does for us and what we have to do so this episode is called the Sons, sorry, Sons of Winter, episode four. So where are we? Are we in Marine? Do you know how many men have stood before me with false tales of my dragons? Desperate men, hoping for wealth, protection. Liars, every one of them. And I expect you are no different. You don't want to see what I do to liars. 
I wouldn't lie to you. You have my word. Your word means nothing. Not when it is so easily bought. Oh, shit. Are you frightened? I thought you'd seen a dragon before. I can't remember half of the dragons, eh? Viserion. It's alright. One run, run in was enough for me, thanks. Clearly. Would you like to touch him? Go ahead. Unless you are afraid. He of looks like he's about to bite my head off. A man who has really faced a dragon before may have reason to be afraid. Go on. Not a good idea, Vesha. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna touch the dragon. Hey, little dragon, dragon. Hey, little dragon, dragon. Oh. Bitch, try to You're bite my finger. At least. <laughs> I don't think he likes me. You still have a hand, don't you? You claim you saw Drogon. Give me a reason to believe you. I told you, I've heard this story before. I'm going to need more than that. I have this. Droga. How did you get that? What have you done to him? If you've hurt him... Hurt I haven't him, done nothing. He attacked us. Drogon wouldn't strike without reason. You must have scared him. He is not some kind of thoughtless beast. He's mm. only a child. <laughs> A child who can breathe fire on whoever he likes. The men who were following us, the Lost Legion, they drew their swords and tried to fight him. And Drogon defended himself. So we somehow deserve to be burnt alive because your little baby was scared. Your tongue is dangerously sharp, sellsword. Why did you They've got me? attitude. You offer me nothing but lies. To what end? You want gold? A title? My undying gratitude? I don't want your money. I just need your help. Help very often means money. My family is depending on me. I have to find an, an army. army. If you could spare some of your cell swords, please. If I you... also came here looking for an army. But what I found were the cries of children. And people suffering in chains while their masters profited from their misery. My cell swords will help me free the slaves of Marine. That is their mission. Your need is not greater than theirs. These are people who have suffered for years without end. What if we left after the liberation? Once the slaves are free? Once the slaves are free, I will sail back to Westeros and reclaim my crown. There is no after. There must be something I can do to convince you. Hey there, little doggy. Dragon. Thing. As we speak, my men prepare to enter Marine. What they are about to do is much bigger than you or I. Bigger than one family back in Westeros. So, unless you think you can storm Marine and free all the slaves yourself, you have nothing more to offer me, Croft. You may leave. Oh, that's but it. Your grace. See them out. I faced a dragon and live. Nothing in Marine can be worse than that. How bold of you. You forget that is my dragon you boast of defeating. I said I survived. Nothing more. And Pesca here, she has a history in Marine. She could help guide us. What the hell? Is this true? <sighs> yes. I lived in Marine for a time. On the eastern side of the city. Fucking bastard. <laughs> so you wish to accompany them? You'd help the Second Sons. Guide them into Marine. I can't, Asher. This could be our only chance. Is that what you're saying? You're really considering this? Anything for you. Within reason, of course. 
Very well. You two will join Croft and his men. Get them into the city, help them liberate Marine, and I will see that you are rewarded. But your uncle stays here. If I find you've lied or put my men in danger. I understand. Good. Croft will get you settled in. It's going to be a long night. A really long night. What the fuck happened back there? Are we really going into Marine? <sighs> Look, I'm sorry it happened this way. As long as you get your arm, right? Best get. Get your armor patched up in here. Extra bed rolls if you need them. Piss buckets in the corner where it's always fucking been. Long time since we had a piss bucket. I spent two years trying to get where I am now. Don't fuck this up for me, Asher. Nail! We got two more! So guys, thank you for watching episode 3, episode 4, chapter 1 and 2, so I shall see you in chapter 3 guys, take care and goodbye.